Hey guys, welcome back to Avorian, the spaceship flying galaxy exploring trading game of wonder and amazement. I am here with my spiky boys and the lady, but actually, actually, I have got a problem that lies in another sector of the galaxy. All the way back towards my core, la the core lands, or I suppose they're not lands, are they? Core sectors. We can come over and switch to this sector over here, for we doth have a craft that needs looking at. This craft has been dry docked, I suppose. He's kind of just been waiting around here for the longest time now because I knew that he wasn't really fit for purpose. As you can see, there's a repair dock. Where, where was it? There was a repair dock around that I had built him from. But back at the beginning of the game, when this guy was my mining ship, he was doing okay. He had these uh, not, our mine, uh, not our mining lasers as opposed to the Ah, uh, mining lasers. But now he is just, he, he's hes old, he's primitive, he needs an upgrade. And I suggest we go to creative mode to go and give this uh, a bit of a facelift. We're coming over to creative mode because I thought I might want to go through a few different designs. Turns out, no, the first one that I hit was absolutely uh, wonderful. So the first thing I needed to make sure, power. I threw down a big old generator down there and uh, then an integrity field generator on above and below just to protect those blocks. The next thing I knew I would be needing as I want to go up to the R mining lasers, they give you resources. I think that's what the R stands for. Who knows? That means I need the uh, cargo holds and uh, I made a nice little like worm type shape. I kind of like what I've got going here, but what I ended up with was much, much better. Uh, I'm going to start placing down a few sloped edges around here because I've got I've got a picture in my head. Now, I didn't I didn't know this at the time, but I was obviously being very inspired by sort of sci-fi orbital based laser weaponry. Uh, looking at the final product, it had to have been where I was going, uh, but I didn't know this. So uh, at this point, I was just like, I want some petals on the side. And so I started making this this weird sort of slopiness. And this, this is really the hardest part of any sort sort of build in Avorian is trying to figure out what slopes you want where. As you see, I'm spinning stuff around and moving stuff around, uh, up, up and down, just just trying to see what fits where. And uh, thankfully, I've decided which which slopes I kind of like to uh, work with. These pylons, protrusions, or petals, whatever you want to call them, are pretty cool. Uh, this inside edge, by the way, was very awkward call to try and figure out what I want to do. But yes, these pylons are really there for my lasers to be put across. In fact, these have multiple, multiple uses. The first one that I want to talk about is to put my salvaging laser on but of course they are also the pieces that are furthest away from my center of gravity meaning that they will be particularly good for having thrusters on and of course they are also being made out of armor so they protect the central core and i put my first pass up on what i wanted these uh, these petal lengths to be like i didn't really like them that much so i uh, scrapped and came back for a slightly stubbier effect uh, and then i wanted to put the, uh, the 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 thrusters on as i had mentioned but put, just slapping them on the edge didn't look so great so i gave them a bit of a, a corner surround and then we we start with the paint job. Of course, we're going with the, uh, the standard purple and uh, green as we have been working here. So I want to uh, just keep that going strong. The green in the middle, the purple on the outside, maybe a touch of color to the internal systems or to the systems on the internal side of it. There's, there's not actually internal systems on here, but there's, there's definitely an internal part and an outside part. Uh, I decided that there wasn't enough power going on and just looking at the stats, there wasn't enough power going on. So I just threw a little bit more down, mainly to keep my uh, shields and engines working properly. There, there was enough power, but there was just there wasn't enough excess going on. And really, all in all, that is my build. I think it looks good. We're going to save it and we're going to transfer it back over. The safe management is actually one of the the highest bits to deal with here. All right, so we've got to build a ship in creative. So what do we need to do to put that in here? Well, we open up the build ship build menu and go to the save designs. In here, we've got a whole bunch of stuff. As I was saying, the save system here is probably one of the hardest things to navigate because you just kind of save everything in the same place. It'd be nice if we had. Some some extra folders. These folders are good for like workshop designs and for templates and stuff like that. Templates are like where I keep little little shapes and stuff. Can I, can I open this up and show you? Look, I got I got all these little weird shapes that I like to use. We could do with some more. But what what we want to do is we want to transfer. Wait, where is it? This one. We want to transfer this one. There's a nice little button down here. Apply design. Uh, I'm not going to change any materials. Maybe if we were up higher than Neonite and Titanium, I might do. No inertial dampener because they only come in iron. Maybe a little bit of an oversight there, but let's let's go with it. Bam! 
Wow, oh, so much bigger. Mm -mm -mm, loving it, loving it. We've got uh, some iron turrets back, uh, mining turrets back. Sorry. Uh, let's let's figure out. Well, I've got to I'm going to spend a few minutes just throwing down some turrets, and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a sec. Actually, before we go and put any guns on there, I have gone and filtered all my systems here to search for unarmed because I want to add a bunch more salvaging slash mining turrets. Well, it's going to be mining turrets here, but this would allow me to put uh, salvaging or mining turrets on. And as you can see, I again don't have a great deal here, uh, so I'm going to just throw these ones on and that will allow me to have a few more this is one of my largest ships now oh that's that's awesome that's really awesome and then do i want to put a cargo extension on it is this going to cost me it's going to cost me more energy but i think we're all right with that okay let's let's just try these for now if we get better if we get better we'll get better and now over here on the uh, of the stats how many unarmed turrets have we got five not great <laughs> Hmm, I must not have searched properly when, when I did originally. For some reason, we couldn't see these first time. Don't ask me why. I, I actually don't know why. Uh, but I'm going to swap them all out for these blue ones. Uh, so I'm totally sure that I want to install the unarmed one permanently here. These other two might want to go into another ship. So I'm, I'm going to keep hold of them as they are for now. That's a plus four, just as it is. Uh, plus six, plus eight amongst those. Oh, yeah. Ten mining lasers. I don't have that many, but let's put on what we've got. <laughs> Yeah, searching by the R mining. Look at this. I've not, I've not got many. I've not got many at all. Okay, that's all the R miners I've got. I've got up as far as. Oh, I did it. I did it. Oh, brilliant. Oh, wonderful. Do we give it a? Uh, you know what? I know exactly what I want to give as the arm, as the arm slot. You see this one up here? A legendary point defense cannon. Do we put it on the back of this? Can it fit somewhere on the back of this? I mean, I don't know whether this would run away if given the order to. Okay, I'm just going to go with a normal chain turret. May maybe taking the uh, the coward's way out there. If you guys think that the point defense would have been a better choice, do let me know. <laughs> but right now, we need to go grab ourselves some crew and find a new asteroid belt to go look at. Oh, look at this beast. Oh, oh wow. Look at the size of me, guys. I'm huge compared to the station. Also... In creative, when you're building in creative, you almost always have some major oversights. And the one that I appear to have is my crew quarters. I completely forgot to make sure we had enough room. Okay, there's no sergeants in this sector, but more importantly, we are out of crew. Well, oh, man, we're more out of crew than I realized we were. Uh, I'm going to try a, a brutal, easy fix. Let's uh, come down it. Wait, wait a moment. What are these made out of? Over here, uh, near night cr crew quarters. Okay, I thought I, I thought there might be an even easier fix. I'm gonna just take this top one here and go. Hey, near night crew quarters. You're here somewhere. Near night crew quarters. Uh, update that. What are we at now? 26 out of 19. I mean, we're getting there. We're getting there. Is it both sides or just this side? Okay, so let's do let's do all these four top bottoms and uh, top bottoms on both sides. 26 out of 29 is sounding a bit better. We've got all the uh, all the miners we need, and we just need three. Oh, that's it. We just need three more uh, sergeants, and we're good. All right, so let's fix the other problem that we had oversighted ourselves into. Uh, first off, deselect everything. Uh, I'm going to grab these two sides and these two sides. Maybe we'll be able to find some, like, block structure in there to do this too, but I then need to scroll up and be like, hey, uh, inertial dampeners. I don't know whether inertial dampeners or thrusters would be better here, but I'm gonna go with the inertial dampeners. Bam, is that better? It stopped it complaining at me-ish. It's only 20 meters per second squared. That's, hmm. I'm like three times faster going forwards than I am backwards. I suppose that's okay. I really like the reticule pattern that's in front of me. It's almost like some sort of like symmetric star, something that would fall out of like a fractal, uh, fractal function. Yeah, that's cool. The little, little one at the top's a bit weird, but that, that's my actual like weapons weapons, right? Wow, this this thing is huge compared to a gate. I've just got, I'm going to go back through. I'm going to waste myself some time, but you guys need to see it. Look, I'm even going to turn this off. Like, watch this, watch it. Like, he is, he is huge. Ah, oh. I'm like, is it going to get to the point where I can't, that I'm going to build a ship that I can't fit through a gate? Is that, is that, a, that, that's totally a possibility. I don't even need to be like, is that? Yeah, of course that's a, like, if this is the size of the ship I'm building now, oh, like, this totally feels like the maximum that would be allowed by any, like, civilization running a, running a gate like this. Another problem that's just been pointed out to me ever since I put those systems in here, I'm, Drawing too much power, but that's fine. I can totally like copy paste and try and put some generators down in here. Uh, I don't know how well we're gonna do here. Okay, I'm gonna put both both planes of uh, reflection on. I've got the the vertical and the horizontal. We're just gonna slap these down like. 
Oh yeah, beautiful. Fine, fine limits though, fine limits. Can we put another one in there and then maybe make this a solid block? Let's have a look and see what that gives me. Uh, 504, oh, sorry. Yeah, 504 right now. It did nothing for me. What? Okay. It is a good looking ship, isn't it? I like it, I like it a lot. Right, with it fully armed and operational. No, I don't want to go into there. I want to abandon this. Oh, I like the way that it puts me outside. I kind of wish it would have put me on the inside. Can I, can I fly around this and just, let's have a quick look while in our little mining drone here shall we this is cool I, I really wanted to put the, uh, the 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 lasers here up on the end I'm not sure if that's a thing we can do or whether the arc of fire comes out of the front or oh, it really doesn't want me flying through here or at least the, the targeting uh, reticule doesn't want me flying through there oh that's cool that's cool anyway we are going to select you and fire you off through our friendly wormhole off you go buddy off you go we're gonna send him off to the near night maybe a little bit further Oof. Bam! Uh, to those zones anyway, and uh, give him a test. Give him a test. And whilst the slag sifter is uh, traveling, me and the boys here, and the lady, of course, are going out exploring the, uh, the unknown sectors. Fill out the map and find those casinos. Oh no, it's a salvaging area. No, 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 it's not a salvaging area. We're okay, we're okay. A food factory, you say? Just normal food, not luxury food normal food okay so we've got another wormhole over here it full-on goes across the galaxy i'm not gonna go find out why because where it goes like all the way around there but I've, I've been finding these like little gate networks in here and it leads me to question whether all the gate networks are actually connected like do these two connect here or well they're gonna connect there aren't they or are there any internal networks that aren't connected to the grand network if you will I, uh, yeah i'd like to know i'd like to know uh, right which way are we going here southeast Oh, this seems like a very well-equipped uh, sector. We've got a research station, a military outpost, an equipment dock. What have we got down here? Shipyard, repair dock, whatever this is. A tube factory. Wow, they have everything. Mm, now this wormhole might be worth checking out. It only seems to jump up here somewhere, but over here, the ship that we've just sent around seems to be having a few issues. It's been sat at the end of this wormhole for a long time, and you would have thought then it couldn't be recharging still because it had like going through the wormhole and stuff like that to, to get all the uh, all its power back up together. I'm going to switch to craft in sector and maybe uh, enter the drone and see what's going on over there. Yeah, this craft just doesn't want to go anywhere. What what you doing, buddy? What you doing? Oh, and he's gone. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe it was a recharge issue. I should have jumped into him and had a look at the numbers. I kind of feel like it was me turning up and, and loading him, though. I, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, this is something I've not seen. A smuggler's hideout. All right, cool. I think we may have actually been here before. Now, where is my... Oh, there they are. Hi, how, how are you doing? Uh, I want to start you off on an automated process because I want to know what happens when you fill up. So let's stop you for now and then send you mining. Let's see what you do. I'm not sure if we're deep enough. I'm not seeing any near night anywhere. But anyway, let, let's do it like... Wow! Did you see that? Did you see that? I'm guessing this blue line here is the uh, the jump drive recharging. Yeah, look at how slow that is. Pirates are attacking this sector. Oh, man, no. This is not what we want. Okay, the real question is, are they attacking me? Now, they appear just to be attacking the, uh, the smuggler's holdout. So I might just leave them to it. Incidentally... Uh, these turrets appear to be on independent targeting. Awesome. That's great. Uh, as long as... Yeah, no, that is great. <laughs> oh, oh, mission updated. Our mining job. Yeah, don't mind if I do. Let's go and have a look at it, shall we? Missions, our mining job. Thank you. Refine ores at a resource depot. Oh, look, look, we've done... Uh done this whatever this is we got the amount of titanium we needed but i feel like we can fill up more i, I think this gray bar is my cargo hold oh, yeah look at that when you ho hover over it it shows you that uh, i'm just gonna, gonna leave it to it i'm almost certain um, we're gonna have to go get it some uh, upgraded mining lasers at some point i don't think the iron ones are going to be able to get all the materials that we want to get hold of like any of the neonite i don't think the iron will We'll mine that away. The titanium might, but we need neonite lasers to mine the next one up. Uh, you always need, like, the one tier below to be able to get the next tier up.
just had a notification saying the cargo bay in this ship is full. Okay, great. So let's go over to the... There they are, Stag Sifter. And be like, hey, okay, so you need to stop. Then we need to go, hey, can you... How do we do this? Uh, refine ores. Is there anything here to refine ores with? No, no, nothing found. Okay, let's look for a refinery. Resource depot. There's the one we need. All right, let's uh, let's tell you to just do a double jump. Ooh. Okay, so all we do is we go, hey, double jump if you could, and then refine. Let's have a look. Watch him go. Watch him go. Oh, it's taking a while to turn. Taking a while to turn. Look at all this like iron just drifting about though. Iron that I can't pick up because it's just not. It's not the way. Actually, wait. Can I pick this up? No, no, I can't refine this stuff. It's only the pre-refined stuff that the other lasers give. What are you up to? Look at him. What are you doing? What are you doing? Stop. Jump. Refine. <laughs> Much better. There we go. Awesome. I know how to play this game. Okay, they're already traveling on their way to the resource depot. Wonderful. I need to make a ship that's just all about speed. Jumping out to this little little craft to come around and watch stuff happen is just it's just a little bit too slow. I'm not sure what the slag sifter is up to over there though. Let's go and have a look. I, th I think they should be tractor beaming. I think they should be tractor beaming their way in. Ah, look, your re refined ores are all done. Pick them up. Okay, so let's uh, let's come over here. Oh wait, have we already just picked them up? I think, I think we may have already picked them up. Look, uh, look at that. Mission accomplished. All right, beautiful. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. Well done. As I can see, everything worked out fine. Indeed, I'm happy to see that you learned so quickly how to use the R mining lasers. Let me give you two of mine to help you on your journey. Okay, beautiful. But they are titanium as well. Oh, oh I love it. <laughs> totally forgot to pull those out there and went to go and install them. We interrupt your regularly scheduled program to bring you a bit of a rampage. There's a pirate sector over here. We're going to go and see if any of these pirates actually have any uh, uh, shields to worry about. If there's no shields, we're just going to roll on through. Oh, yes. All right, let's go up to this guy first. A Ravager. Okay, I think a Ravenger. No, no, there's no end there. It's a Ravager. Okay, let's just fire a few of these. 15, 16 kilometers too far away. Uh, how about 8, 7, 5? Yeah, not quite insta-dead, but that's pretty good. Turn around. Where's my back? up they are um, just kind of hanging around over there i think we're good though they uh the pirates don't appear to really care all that much i am having trouble slowing down go okay pile of bits pile of bits what, what are all my other crew doing they don't they just don't seem to care they just don't seem to care to be fair these pirates also don't seem to be that bothered uh, here we go. This guy would like to come and avenge his friend. Uh, I, of course, welcome them the opportunity, uh, mainly because it's, you know, prowess time. Uh, finally, the lady and the grandest entrance are at my flank, giving me all the assistance I could ever ask for. Uh, as long as I can keep this guy in my targeting sights, it should all work out. You know what? This guy here who's firing at me, let's, uh, let's deal with him, shall we? I think we're going to end up with uh, quite the salvage operation after this. <laughs> a little awkward to not get into the lady's range of fire. I'll we'll have to uh, try and avoid that from the future. Hey, 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 hey. Don't be shooting at my lady now. Is that, them? Is that all of them? No, nope, here comes some more. That's cool. Do we go and take on that that uh, that shipyard over there? Or should we just go around and cruise up and pick up all these bits first? I think that one might be the winner. All right, nothing overly interesting in the pickup there. Oh, this guy wants to shoot at me as well. Okay, I'm going to strafe sideways and let him also pick on uh, the other ships in my fleet. Hopefully, we're just going to be eating through this. This shouldn't take too long. Uh, that said, uh, we have done about a fifth of it so far. I'm, uh, again, just strafing, strafing, strafing. Uh, I don't know whether they're going to call in any sort of assistance. Yeah, behind us, look. Okay, I'm going to turn around and take those out. Or are my other ships going to take them out? I don't know. I don't know. How do we... Uh, is there a way of giving them particular orders? Being like, this ship here goes and attacks stations. This ship here goes and defends me. I don't know. I don't know. I'd like to... I'd like that to be a thing, but I've got a feeling, given how generally disappointed uh, I have been with the AI control... Where's the ship asking for help? Is the rent Let's go help him out. Look, look at him over there. Uh, we, can, we can definitely go and get this, whilst we are also under attack ourselves. Yeah, that's how confident I am about this. Uh, if we could just get in close enough to begin with. I'm a little bit worried about overshooting, but of course, we should be fine. Hey, how's it going? Let's, uh, can, we, can we get a distance reading? Four, three, that's, that's cool, that's cool. That's actually doing damage distance. Uh, if I can just get in there and find the ones... Ah, oh, no, 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 don't, don't you be blowing up. Don't you be blowing up. Uh, where, where's the lady and, and such forth? 
Hopefully back at the station. Okay, you dead. And then finally, you. Okay, thank you. We have transferred a reward. 60,000 credits. Beautiful, beautiful. Uh, try not to shoot our new friend. Ah, oh, no, he might have died anyway. Okay, itchy face stopped me talking there, but uh, we're back in with some more combat. Yeah, due to the turmoils in this sector, it's a hazard zone. You bet I am in this zone. It's a hazard to anyone who's not friendly. Anyway, that's the reinforcement cleanup, I think. I think. Look at that space station. Spa oh, oh, more pirates. Hey, how are you guys doing? Are you having a party without me? Didn't even let me know. Wow, rude. There's a lot of them here as well. Maybe more than I was expecting. Okay, that's the grandest entrance down. No problem. Uh, wow, well, I mean, it's a bit of a problem. If I had known that this was going on behind me, I probably would have turned around and been a little bit more serious about it. How are my shields and stuff doing? Pretty bad, actually. Pretty bad. Let's just... Uh, try and rip a few of these guys apart on my way through uh i really need to try and shoot that these guys I, I need to just lay um distract these guys from the lady that's what i'm trying to say distract these guys from the lady uh just just any sort of bullets in ships will help am i am i taking some damage i'm taking a fair amount of damage but it's not so much there we go that's enough for it to be a problem now okay so let's just try and outpace them a little bit if we can we all right who's gonna be silly enough to try and come for me first is the grandest entrance gone uh sorry the lady is the lady gone maybe no there's the lady okay all right let's let's go and give her a hand uh whilst my shield regen okay that that's fine i'm a little bit worried that she's gonna die but that's that's life i suppose that's how it goes i don't know what speed i want at uh, what distance i want to start properly laying in it's a shame we're not really taking these guys out as fast as we were uh hubris is feeling quite large now but that's fine i mean that's the way of empires you uh you, you, you're flying high right up until the moment it all goes wrong for you uh can we get some actual damage down that'd be great nine Whoa, nine kilometers a little far but i reckon we could probably close the gap and help out trying to help out the lady is the winner here very very much try and aim a little bit more up if i could all right nice 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 and anytime we can combine our firepower it's going to be more effective than just one of us on our own Woo, how are you feeling, lady? Feeling a little bit beaten up? I also am feeling a little bit beaten up, but I think we'll be okay. <laughs> oh. All right, turn around. Let's see who's going to get closest first, because that would be a mistake for them. Yeah, all right, that's one down. Here comes the next, and then this one over here as well, hopefully. Now, is it just infinite waves? That That's a question I have. Uh, oh, that... <laughs> That's uh, some good flying there, some good flying. But yeah, is it is it constant waves or do we get to actually uh, run these out in the end? Uh, I am I'm just I'm sitting duck right now. What am I doing? What am I doing? I'm trying to fly around, but it's not working the best. Okay, where's the next guy? He's over there. Must have just gone a little bit out of range for him. Uh, let's come back and do a joust. Whoa. Can we select him? See where he's at? Nine, probably about here, I reckon. He's traveling very fast. Very difficult to get the right shot in. Uh, where, where is the lady? She's much more accurate than me. Much more accurate. i got the firepower. She's got the precision, you know? I'm just kind of like pumping up and trying to trying to get somewhere near the front of his trajectory. Let's see what happens if we put some more shells in the, in the space station. Man, I really wanted to take this place out, but I think it might even... Uh, be a little bit too much maybe maybe i mean we could totally in the time it takes me to drift drift over there um make the grandest entrance at one of the other sectors no i think we actually need to be personally present to be able to do that that's a bit of shame bit of a shame 20 kilometers to go uh if there are more pirates turning up then we just run away uh, i mean i'm just gonna in fact before we do that i'm going to enter coordinates down here and now we're gonna try and do this okay we have a jump route calculated i'm gonna come in and get a little bit closer my shields are doing some business here that's pretty good uh, keep turning, keep moving. Uh, I'm going to let this just kind of drift on past, if at all possible. How am I doing? That's that's some pretty serious damage, actually. That's pretty serious. The real question is, can they take out my shield with the capabilities that they have? 
Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm noticing a, a very distinct lack of turrets on this guy compared to the ships we we're facing. I'm going around in big circles to try to try and keep an eye on any uh, pirates that might spawn in on us. Uh, I definitely feel like this face here is the one that does the most damage to us. If I'm sat right here, right where I am, uh, then the uh, the ang angles of fire are real. But I think we got this. I think we might have this. I'm getting no no information about extra ships coming in to cause us some trouble. Uh, also feeling like the lady coming to back me up has really helped us out. So let's even drift to a bit of a close, a bit of a stop. Not a full stop, just a slower stop. No, nah, maybe not actually. That's going to... Give my, uh, give my shields just a little bit too much to worry about. It keeps telling me I'm facing the wrong direction because I'm pressing space to speed up my ship. I'm also noticing that there's actually there's some great big holes in the middle of this. I didn't, I didn't notice that. I wonder how many times my bullets have gone flying right through the middle. Though the damage appears to be, appears to be great, m maybe even terminal. I think, I think we might have this. I think we might finally have this. As long as the lady can carry her portion of the pie, it should be fine. Ah, oh, yes. Hey lady, hey lady, do you want to do me a favor? Get your salvage on. Ooh-wee, guys, that was a bit more effort than I was expecting, but I like it. Okay, I'm going to see if I can't jump down to my home sector now. Yeah, okay, so I can just jump to my home sector. Brilliant. So I'm going to switch over there and get the grandest entrance back online. All right, back at the home sector. Am I outside the resource? That's not what I need. Where is the repair dock all right beautiful beautiful oh and also my mining ship is done but first before we get onto that the one one of the amazing things about the repair dock is all the way from over here you can reconstruct your ship and get put inside it oh isn't it great and then i'm going to repair uh, buy a reconstruct token very very important so my plan is to shift myself over to the mining ship but before we do that i want to send the grandest entrance on a uh, a small little excursion back to my other craft all right, so this one up here says it is full. Unfortunately, we cannot do a, uh, a resource dock anywhere close by, so we're going to have to jump it back through the gate and then do a refine ores. It's a bit, bit micromanagey, but I think we can deal with it. I think we can deal. And deal with it, I have, by collecting my entire fleet together. You can see we've got the uh, the slag sifter over there and green rocks. Very important that we've got green rocks around. The lady is following me and the grandest entrance is providing escort for the mining ship. So we're going to hang around here for a little while. One thing I do want to point out, though, is if we have a look in here, find the smugglers. Wait, weren't we just in an area where there was a smuggler's hideout? So I think I know what we're going to be doing and next time. Uh, but in between then, I'm going to just be letting this guy go around and do do his, uh, his mining self and uh, p possibly fight a whole bunch of pirates and aliens that come in and, dis uh, and disturb us. But I will see you then when we're going to do that. Bye.